Welcome in to Hit Sticks from the Star in Frisco with Barry Church and Isaiah Stanback. I'm Kyle Yeomans. We're going into the bye week. It's competition time. Winner doesn't do any push-ups. Loser has 50 push-ups. We'll tell you what the stipulations are next. Cowboys get a big time win 20 to 17 over the Chargers and in that win Dak Prescott used the mobility yet again. He had an 18 yard rushing touchdown on a fourth and one crucial play call read option. He fakes it to Tony Pollard nearly fumbled the snap but then he gets off to the races 18 yards out longest rushing score by a Cowboys quarterback since John Kitna in 2010. So Isaiah Stanback, I know you like to run the ball. You like to run it as a quarterback. You show off that mobility. How did Dak Prescott get the job done? Well, he has all of his attention on the end man on the line of scrimmage. Yes. So uh, that's where all your attention goes as a quarterback. You're reading the end man, not the DN, but the end man on the line of scrimmage. On this particular play, as we see it here, you got Khalil Mack. Okay, if Khalil Mack goes down, okay, down the line of scrimmage, chasing the running back that's going across the formation, then you pull. That's mm -hmm. your indicator. You pull the ball, you get around the corner, you get as much juice as you can, and hopefully you end up in the end zone like Dak did. Here we go. Here we go. Mm. Mm. Wide open spaces. Ooh, okay. Mm. Gas. You make a miss. Ooh, okay. almost. That's the tack we've been looking forward <laughs> to seeing right now. All right, here. let's go ahead and take a peek at it real quick so you guys can see from Dak's perspective what this looks like, okay? We just talked about how you're reading the end man on the line of scrimmage, okay? As you guys see it, there goes Khalil Mack, okay? As soon as Khalil Mack decides that he wants to now cross face and chase Tony Pollard. That is the indicator. You guys can see the space behind Khalil Mack. That's the exact space that Dak Prescott saw in the game. He's going to go ahead and put his twinkle toes on, make sure them laces are tied up, and now he's going to hit it. Boom, put your foot in the ground, ah, make mm. one man miss, ah, try to run another man over. Scored it in the game. That's all that really mattered. We try to duplicate it here. Yeah, and exactly. When you're talking about from the defensive perspective right here, there's got to be somebody responsible for the quarterback, whether that's that linebacker looping back around or if Khalil Mack shouldn't have been on that play. But somebody on the defensive end has got to be responsible for the quarterback. Dak Prescott did a heck of a job right here and a great call by McCarthy. He's seen these defensive ends crashing down on the run. We see Khalil Mack do the same thing right here. Dak Prescott does a heck of a job pulling the ball out and making a play for his team. As we saw what happened in real life, he was able to get a touchdown. Here is another big time play. So it was a big time play and call for the Dallas Cowboys. It took some extra grit for the Cowboys, just like that play with Dak Prescott to get the job done against the Chargers. We're going to see just what Isaiah and Barry's grit looks like as we go to our hit stick Super Bowl. It's the bye week, no preview, all competition. When we come back, we'll set the stage and see who wins the bet payoff when we come back. Cowboys Hit Sticks, presented by Madden NFL 24, is also brought to you by Academy Sports and Outdoors, the official sporting goods retailer of the Dallas Cowboys, and by AT&T, official sponsor of the Dallas Cowboys. This segment is brought to you by Academy Sports and Outdoors, official sporting goods retailer of the Dallas Cowboys. It's a bye week edition of Hit Sticks, which means it's time for some competition. We're going to put Isaiah Stanback and Barry Church to the test. Who is superior at Madden NFL 24? It's the Hit Sticks Super Bowl here from the star in Frisco. Okay, here's the rules on our first challenge. It's third down and five. Isaiah Stanback, of course, on offense. He's wearing the white jerseys. Barry Church will always be on defense. He's in the Navy jerseys. This is third down and five, so the line to gain is the 25-yard line. Isaiah, you get three plays to try and convert. If you do, it's a point. If Barry converts, it's a point. So let's get things started. Isaiah, how are you going to convert on third down in Madden? 
I just got to step on the field, Kyle. Oh, <laughs> I mean, yeah. I mean, that's all I really got to do. I mean, you see it's third and five, and my man's already playing eight yards off of C.D. Lamb, my number one receiver. Oh. So I have my guys four wide over here to the right. Tony Pollard's going to get in the mix. One of the best receiver running backs in the league. Been underutilized, but I'm going to utilize him because O.C. IRS is about to make it happen, Cabin. Man, I hear nothing but lies going on over here <laughs> to the left of me. I mean, when we look at the record, I think I'm like 100 and, and maybe six losses uh, total, I think. I mean, look, DCBC <laughs> has run Madden since we started this thing a couple years years ago and it's not gonna stop here so what you see I'm gonna do with this defense I'm gonna go ahead and adjust yeah you might want to press up get these guys down in the face of the of adversity we're gonna go ahead and lock these boys up and we'll see if Prescott got anything for us you see what Hooker's Ooh, going on you, you better, see who's you better put somebody over the top of lamb that's all Ooh, I know okay here we go Knock oh! Oh! That's one point for the good guy. Oh! I'm telling you. Okay. It's just going to add up from here. All right, I it's going to add up from here. I see what we're doing here. Okay. Let me make some adjustments real quick. Make some adjustments real quick. You, you feel got me? what you need. Okay, I see. You it ain't bring, looking good. You want to bring some pressure. Mm -hmm. Ease up on the pressure. It. It's all about adjustments. Mm -hmm. I'm going to come on with it. I'm going to come on with it. Put Gallup in the slot. Okay. House. No, sir. Oh! No, sir. That should be worth about seven points. No, sir. Once again, like I told y'all from the start. All right, I'm 100 dubs. Oh, 101 dubs. Okay. But now six losses. All right. I mean, this is easy work for me out here. You sure you want to do this thing? Oh, we're coming back Are again. Are you sure you Best want to do believe this thing? that. All right, here we go. I see what we're doing here. That's supposed to be a touchdown. You know that. Mm -mm. It's okay. Mm -mm. It's okay. Mm -hmm. okay, traditional yeah. out here, three by one. Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and hunt. Parsons, go ahead and hunt. Go ahead and hunt, Parsons. Mm -mm. No. Mm -mm. What you going to do? What you going to do? Bruh. Oh, my. Get this Bruh. man off of the sticks. That's the old line. Get this man off of the We need That's adjustments, sir. We, we need, need adjustments. adjustments. You, okay. should, you want me you know to call what? the dogs nah, off? Nah, you know what I'm going to do? do? What you going to no, do? I got to choose, choose a new play because obviously you know what I'm running. So it's okay. It's okay. All right, I'm going to go real quick. Real quick, go ahead and line it up. I'm going to make the adjustments real quick. I'm going to make it a little easier on you. Nah. I mean, it's that, Don't that, do that. I'm up to 103 do dubs now. I mean, this is, <laughs> this is getting outrageous right now. Just got to gain five yards. Okay. That's it. We just got to gain. I'm need five. I'm going to call the dogs off. Just need five. Go ahead and back up. Did there. Uh-huh. Make sure, you, got, make sure uh, you pick the right one. Uh -huh. All right. Got the right Boom. Here we go. All right. You ready? All right. Here we Let's go. Do it, real man. quick in a hurry. Boom. Got action, Jackson. That's all oh, I need. Did he get five? That's all I need. That's all I, I need. I don't know if he got five. That's all I need. I don't know That's if all he I got need. five. All right, let's go ahead and break this one down. I'm going to zoom out real quick, okay? I've been dropping back a little bit further than I probably should have with this pass rush. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and get B. Cooks involved, okay? okay? Last game, B. Cooks made an appearance against the Chargers, so why not? Let's go ahead and get him involved. So I see the one-on-one -on -one matchup right here. I see the middle's been getting vacated, mm -hmm. so I'm going to give him the space to work. Boom, put your foot in the ground. Look at all that space right there. Ball's out his hand already. He should already have it in his hands, but the ball's on the way. Let's go ahead and zoom in so you guys can see it from his perspective. Boom, that's what he's looking at, okay? QB1 right there. Ball's coming towards him. Boom, J. Lou can't get there in time. Even if you get hit in the back, you're playing basketball in post game, baby. That's a first down. That's a first down. And we look at it from a defense perspective. I, I called the dogs off. I mean, I, I oh. felt bad for <laughs> Dak Prescott and the IRS in this offense. I didn't want to keep lighting them up. So I called the dogs off. I backed off both of my linebackers. One had man to man on Tony Pollard. I believe that was Van Der Esch in this situation. And then Damone Clark backed off and was that low rat player, meaning he's going to do all the crossers. Anything in the middle of the field, he's responsible for. As we see, LV Eagle went up there and locked down Tony. Pollard. We see Damone Clark in the middle of the field right there between the hashes, patrolling the middle. But this was a good read by Dak Prescott and IRS right there. That's the only matchup that they could exploit out there because that defense, it was locked down. All right, so through one segment, even with a bonus play kind of thrown in there in the mix, Isaiah trails Barry Church 3-1. to one. But when we come back here on Hit Sticks, there's more points at stake in our red zone segment. Can the Cowboys get creative in the red zone? Isaiah might be able to show a thing or two to head coach Mike McCarthy when we come back. This segment was brought to you by Academy Sports and Outdoors, official sporting goods retailer of the Dallas Cowboys. We are through one segment of our Hit Stick Super Bowl here in 2024. Barry Church versus Isaiah Stanback, and we've got our makeshift scoreboard here. Barry, three, IRS, one. And here's the thing. We went back and reviewed it as a production crew, and that interception back in the first segment 
We're going to give a half point to Barry <laughs> Church for each point of these five, turnovers. Right so there's no ties allowed, just a 3.5 <laughs> moving into the rest of this competition segment. So here we are at the 10 yard line. We're setting things up in the red zone. Of course, the red zone has been a hot button topic for Cowboys Nation this year. Mike McCarthy has had his fair share of struggles as a play caller. Cowboys able to get the job done a couple different times, even with those red zone struggles. So we're going to give a challenge to IRS here. Isaiah Stanback at the line of scrimmage. How do you get in the end zone against this defense? If he does, he's got three plays. They're each worth three points. If Barry gets a stop, it's worth two points. And then, of course, with a turnover would be another half. So, Isaiah, how do you get the job done? How are you going to find pay dirt against Barry Church? Well, I got to get some movement going on. I'm just lining up. So, I got to go ahead and get my man CD, work him across the formation, much like we saw him do against the Chargers. Okay. And then once I see what they do, okay, then you make your adjustments. Okay, they didn't bump out. Let's me know right off the bat is zone. <laughs> you know, see? Uh, it doesn't see. matter if you got double A gaps or not. And now we got options. We've got options out here. We're going to yeah. see what we got, man. I want to know if Dak Prescott and IRS can combine can to get on the, the same end page. zone. We, <laughs> can they get on the same page? Because right now this defense is clicking on all cylinders. Backs. Let's see what can happen here. Here we go. Oh, Bruh. you had them too. <laughs> you had them too. But that's what this defense is known for. Man. Pressure right. off the edge. If you don't get rid of it quick, that defense is hunting out there. And as we see, Parsons once again gets to Dak Prescott. All right. Can we get there though? You know what? Let me go bruh, ahead and switch it. Let bruh, me go ahead and I, switch it hey, up. Hey, listen, now, I'm pressing the button. I got I gotta wait for my guys to get the ball off, man. We'll give you a chance right here, man. We're gonna give you a chance. Trash. on the credit, break trash. on the cash. Once again, Gilmore making a play. Can we go check it out? Yeah, the let's go to the instant replay real quick. And check this I thing I'm out. I need Dak Prescott to put the ball on the money, man. What? I got guys open, man. What's going on offensively? I don't know, man. Number, we got to talk to four. We got to call a friend or something man, like that right now. Something got to happen. Something he's not happen. reading this defense. As we see here, I, I gave you that man-to-man -man look at the beginning mm -hmm. just to see if, it, if you would fall into the trap, and yes, you did. Because I went in there and played a cover two, backed it off at the snap of the ball to confuse IRS, confuse Dak Prescott. Uh -huh. And as we see right here, Gilmore does a great job on the right side, sinking on the credit, making uh -huh. sure he has his safeties help over there with that, that corner route, and breaking on the cash. He doesn't throw it to that flat, throws it to the corner. Gilmore does a great job breaking mm -hmm. it interception for the good guys. I, Kyle, I don't know, does that count as five points? I mean, what is going on in the red zone and out in the field? DCBC has come to play. Y'all better y'all put some hey, respect on my name. So you, you got four and a half on this one play, basically. Mm. I mean, you got, you got the two early, you got the two and a half here, but you got one more play to get back to IRS. You got All a right. chance to make up some ground Listen here up. if you can find the end zone. Listen, that's exactly what I wanted. I knew he was in cover two. Got the mm. look, exactly the look I wanted. Yeah, I just need four to put the ball on the money, man. That's all it Makes is. More adjustments. That's all it is. I'm about to put another number four in there real quick that I know. Uh -oh. Here we go. Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. Things happen fast down here. You got to be accurate. Man. Ooh, making adjustments. I like it. Cross face. Oh, he get snuck in it in there. Gotta get in there. Gotta get in there. <laughs> yeah, swim. Okay. Swim, swim. Okay, I'll get you on that one. All right. You want to run one more? We can do it. Whatever you, you want, want to you do. Want another if, you, one? If, you, if you feeling frog, you go listen, ahead man, and leave. Listen, I, need, I, got, I, need, I need points. All right, here we I go. I need now. points. Oh, 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 I don't like that now. Hold on. Uh -huh. I don't like that. Oh, let's go. That's not happening. Oh, come on. You got to get back in the happening. end zone, man. Hey, good defense. Good defense again. I'll go ahead and go and show you guys exactly what I was trying to do. What I was trying to do. Okay, I'm not getting the effectiveness I want out of, out of, out of QB4 right now. But here we go, okay? What I'm looking for is this inside matchup, straight off the back, okay? I have a flat route going out there with Michael Gallup. I have a corner route out there with Fergie. All right, and I got C.D. Lamb coming right here on the inside on the seam. Really trying to make things difficult. Probably should have went to Fergie. Boom, that's wide open right wide there in the corner open. route, okay? But this is what I see as well, okay? You see that step that he has on Deron Bland right there? Mm -hmm. That's what I'm looking for. There's nobody back there for the help, okay? I'm trying to put this thing in the back of the end zone, okay? You got to put a little air on it, what, we call, what we call a goal post throw, okay? okay. okay. Just, just a little bit of a loft to get mm -hmm. it over the stretched arms and drop that thing in a bucket. Doesn't get enough air on it. Great play by Deron Bland. He's been doing it all year long. Go ahead and back it up. Boom, you got to see him get the hands on him. Rides him, mm, rides him, rides him. Mm. Boom. Ball's right there. He gets his eyes to the ball. Great job with the SWAT. Got to make those throws. Should have been intercepted. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So as you can see, our updated scoreboard, Barry Church 10 with that six and a half point outing in the segment.
but Isaiah IRS, he had a nice little three-pointer with the touchdown to C.D. Lamb. So here's the thing. It goes to real-time points when we come back here on Hit Sticks. We're starting at the 50-yard line. Got to drive to score. That's the key. Five plays for IRS when we come back right after this. We are two segments down, one more to go here in our Hit Stick Super Bowl for 2024. Alongside Barry Church and Isaiah Stanback, I'm Kyle Yeomans, where the score sits at 10 to 4. Barry over Isaiah. However, touchdowns count for six points in this one and could set up a winner take all two point conversion. Here's the scenario it's a full drive for Isaiah Stanback, except there's really no first downs. He can't go backwards but he also can't pick up a first down. It's five plays to get into the end zone from the midfield marker. So Barry, you've had a ton of success to this point. How do you keep Isaiah at bay in terms of this offense? Well, Kyle, you know, they don't call me the coach of the year for no reason. <laughs> so far, so far throughout this game, it has been a bludgeoning. As you can see, I'm up 10 to four. So what we're going to do here, I don't like what you got going on as far as bunch wise. What's, what's wrong with it? I don't, I don't it? like, I don't like what you got it? going on. So I'm going to back my guys up. Oh, Usually I'm pressing. Usually I'm charity. all in the face of these guys, <laughs> but I don't like what you got going on. Too many pick situations mm -hmm. I see over there. So I'm back my guys up and we'll play that bend but don't break defense okay let's see if Dak Prescott can be accurate and patient enough to get this team down the field let's yeah. see well, I, don't, don't be scared go ahead don't bring your boys up man bring your <laughs> right, boys up there what here we go oh the run uh oh uh oh we got action we got action we got the positive game right, you gotta take the ball out the hands of the folks sometimes okay <laughs> all right he had a little bit too much stress on him today. Yeah, yeah so mm -hmm. had to get TP involved. You know, we got to get our playmakers the ball in their hands at times. I see the X over there on fire. He's on fire. Yeah. You know what that means. I know He's coming that to hunt. Means. Here we go. Uh-oh. We got movement, yeah, boss. Got okay. okay. All the way down to the – okay, I see what you got going Let's see what else you got here. I don't like how you did that. I don't you like don't how like you're moving the ball on me right now. Yes, I mean, it's, I mean, so far, it's getting a little sticky right now. Three yes, plays left. I mean, you only got about 20-some yards to get in there. Listen, man, I got to tighten up. You got to tighten up. I had a little scout report, you know what I'm saying? Oh, the first, so you, little birdie told you little something? Little birdie told me All right. something. All right. <laughs> when I got to tighten up, you know what that means. Oh, quick snap. Oh, okay, okay. Rally and tackle. Oh, ooh, that was Rally close there. Four. Oh, that was close right. there, boy. Rally and tackle. All right, you stopped that. It was close. It was close. It was close. Rally and tackle. Yep, Rally okay. Tackle. See, you got, got curse out there. Mm -hmm. Let's see what you're doing right there. Okay, let's see what we can make happen here. Damn. Oh! Mm. oh, 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 oh. Mm. Can't and forget about that man. That mama, there goes that man. Parsons off of the edge. There goes that man. It's okay. I'm going to run it back one time. Run it back one time. Last play, right? This is, you sure you, this is what you want. Last this is play. what you want right here. Okay. Last play. Last play, Captain. I'm going to go ahead and switch things up on you real quick. Get that umbrella defense going on. Mm hmm I'll make a couple adjustments. A couple adjustments. Here we go. Oh, no, sir. Oh! 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 Down <laughs> at the one. Way to rally and tackle. Let's, let's, let's take a look at this. You want to take, take a peek at it? It was close, though, that was, a, that was a good play. That was, that was a really good play. I felt good one. about it. I felt good about it. All right, I knew you was going to stay in too high safety. Mm -hmm. I already knew there was, there was no, no issues there. So okay. OCRS predicted it right. All right, I slid my protection, my protection to the left, put a big Tyron Smith over there on the left side, mm -hmm. made sure I kept Tony Pollard in on the blocking, okay? Because I knew you were going to have a little pressure. A little something coming. A little something okay. coming. All right, I know you can't help yourself, okay? <laughs> C.D. Lamb took a little longer than I wanted him to to get yeah. off the ball right here. You guys see the issue he has. Not C.D., but um, uh, Brandon, Brandon Cooks. Cooks yeah. B. Cooks got held up a little bit, okay? Because of that, boom, now C.D. has to run the hump. Okay, mm -hmm. because he has to run the hump, it takes a little longer to get into the hole that I'm looking mm. for. But you see the timing. That was perfect. You see the timing. As soon as he perfect. gets a little bit of an edge on top of J. Lou, the ball is released. Boom, now I'm counting on him to be able to break this tackle, get in the zone, end it up one yard short, just like the St. Louis Rams of old school. <laughs> Man, you ain't lying about that. That was a heck of a play call. I'll give you that one because I, I switched up my defense from a blitz to kind of an umbrella tile style defense, a cover two, and you hit it right in the honey hole, right where you're supposed to be. Great accuracy from Dak Prescott back there. Great picking up the block, something that we've seen from Tony Pollard this last week. He's done a great job picking up blitzes right here, right in the honey hole. C.D. Lamb just couldn't stretch one more yard mm. to get it in there. Another win for the good guys. That puts me at 107 and <laughs> six losses. There we go.
<laughs> Isaiah was one yard shy. He had the right play call. CD Lamb breaks that tackle. We're going to a two point conversion. But hey, Crown Berry Church, DCBC got the job done. We'll talk about it coming up in our next segment. We got a fan question. We're giving away a copy of Madden NFL 24. We'll ask you what's going on with this play calling with the Dallas Cowboys. Does it make you confident going into the post by week regular season? Wrapping up a bye week edition of Hit Sticks from the Star in Frisco with Barry Church. I'm Kyle Yeomans. This is Isaiah Stanback. Let me see that controller here, sir. Yeah, go, go ahead and get sticks. down. You can just keep rolling until the, the end of the show. Let's rip off the jacket. We got to get the push ups rolling. Yes. Yes. While Isaiah's mm. doing the bet payoff and he's getting the push ups in, turning the hat around backwards, that's good form. That mm, it good. is good form. Barry, we've got a fan question. This okay. comes from Christian. Is there something scheme wise the Cowboys? can put on the table to help jumpstart the run game, or is it just the offensive line playing better? Well, to me, I would love to see them use Tony Pollard's speed more, which means getting him out on the perimeter. But at the end of the day, running the football is a mind state. So this offensive line, they've got to get more physical. They've got to go ahead and impose their will on imposing defenses. And I feel like that running game, it'll start to tick up a little bit. Of course, second time the offensive line's been together as a whole. So yes. plenty more time to get better as they go along going into the bye week. Enjoy the bye week, everybody, for Barry Church. Isaiah Stanback. I'm Kyle Yeoman saying so long on hit sticks. That's 50. Isaiah's got them all done. That's 50. <laughs> Cowboys hit sticks presented by Madden NFL 24 was also brought to you by Academy Sports and Outdoors, the official sporting goods retailer of the Dallas Cowboys and by AT&T, official sponsor of the Dallas Cowboys.